This is my entry for the Flashing Light Prize 2017. It consists of a grain of wheat bulb with a diameter of about 1.4 millimeters and an AT Tiny 10 microprocessor in a small SOT23 package. And here's the schematic. Here's a close up of the AT Tiny 10, which in my project is programmed to flash out the words flashing light prize in Morse code. That's one of the unique aspects of my entry. Uh, it may not be smaller than Mr. Applied Physics entry, but I think it's unique in that I'm flashing Morse code. For scale, here's my completed apparatus next to a ruler. You can get a feel for the size of the thing. It's basically like half a centimeter long or maybe five millimeters. It can be more compact, but I just can't solder all that precisely with my old fingers. Back in 2014, I got fascinated with the AT Tiny 10, which you can see in this little header right here. At the time, there was not much software support for it, so I wound up writing my own actual IDE and integrated it with the, um, the, uh, the GNU AVC compiler and built this little programmer board here that uses relays so I can switch the device under test over here back and forth between the programmer and actually running in circuit. This gives me kind of a crude in-circuit emulator. Since running the code here on a little test setup, I, I breadboarded up before I wired up the final version or, or started up the final version. There's more about this on my webpage, uh, Wayne's Tinkering page. I'm mean, actually in the process of updating the, the IDE to uh, include a few more features and perhaps run under Windows. So if anybody's interested in that, just drop a comment below, and I probably will eventually publish that in some form again. The old version is still available, but it's essentially Mac only at the moment, which is primarily what I develop under. I'll give you a quick overview of the code. This is actually a snapshot of my little, or a screen capture of my IDE that I wrote. So behind it, you can see IntelliJ, which is the my Java programming tool of choice. My IDE is entirely written in Java, except for the native um, GNU compiler it uses. The um, start off by defining a few constants. Um, it just shows the pin out at the top for the, the chip itself for reference. I'm running at 8 megahertz clock speed. The chip is an AT Tiny 10. Then down near the bottom, you can see there's a, um, a table called letters. That's the table that encodes the Morse code. Basically use a byte per letter where the lower four is the pattern and the upper four encodes the number of, of dots and dashes inside. Then I initialize the AT Tiny chipset itself, set ver uh, various timers and so forth. Then I have an interrupt routine that gets called periodically basically at the at the dot rate for the Morse code. It reads a text string, which you can see right here in the middle, it says, says flashing light prize. Oh, they had a test message that just flashes SOS because that's a bit easier to recognize as you've got it correct. Um, it unpacks the, the string one character at a time and then converts that into a uh, the, the appropriate Morse code and then converts that into the dot dash a pattern to flash out and down at the very last part of the code is where it flashes that that pattern out. It's a pretty straightforward bit of code. Um, took me, I think, maybe about an hour or so to write.